Hi, this is Sasha from theautismhelper.com, and this is a product preview of my election unit for early childhood or special education. So I'm going to take you through all the different resources in this packet. It's a pretty big packet, so I want to make sure you get an idea of everything that's in here. Um, so there are 12 different vocabulary words that I used for this unit. So there is a flashcard for each of them. So the words are vote, Washington, D.C., president, vice president, White House, political party, Democratic party, Republican party, debate, election, ballot, and polling place. So those are the words that we focus on in all of these activities. Um, the first activity is an adapted book. It's a 12-page adapted book, and here are the pictures, and there's some instructions on how to set this up. So the book is kind of a little story, kind of going through the definitions of the different vocabulary words, and the students can match the picture right here. This is a great way to involve students with lower um, verbal abilities or non-readers. They can still engage in a literacy activity and be... Um, participating it by matching the picture. So you'll laminate these pictures, put soft Velcro on the back, and then put hard Velcro on all these boxes. And as you read it, they can match the picture. So this book, like I said, is 12 pages. So all the different pages in this book um, goes through, uses all the vocabulary words. Um, you can bind this or you can put it in top loading sheets too. So I made this book general about the election, not specific to this one, because I realized the book I had made for last the last presidential election I now couldn't use. So this is just a general election book, and then I made it kind of an add-on. So these are three pages that are about this year's election. So you could use these separately, or you could include these in the book too. So then you can take them out if you wanted to use this in four years, say. So these four, three pages are really simple facts about this year's election. So there's three different ones of those. Um, then we can kind of go into the worksheets. Um, there are seven different comprehension worksheets um, of varying degrees on writing the definition or filling in, um, drawing a picture to kind of show comprehension that way, and matching word to definition with a word bank. So there's a few different types of those kind of worksheets. Then there's 12 different types of, or no, 15, I'm sorry, different types of matching sheets. There's three different kinds. Here's just matching picture to picture. So this is nice for your lower learners that are just working on matching so they can still be involved in the concept. Um, this is matching word to picture, a few different ones of those. And this is just matching pictures again. So they'll circle this one, circle this one. So this is great for... Um, your lower learners as well, because this is kind of a different way to work on matching. So there's a bunch of those, and then we get into the games. So there's a bingo game, and there's two levels of playing. So this level is just with pictures and the word. So this is great for picture identification, vocabulary, and matching. Um, all learners can be involved in this because it's pretty easy. The second set of cards is a little bit harder. It just has the definition. So I like to not show the kids the cards and just read the definition and see if they can identify the vocabulary word on their own. So this is really good for comprehension. And then here are the bingo boards. So a bunch of different ones of those. All the bingo boards. And then the last game we have is I Have Who Has. This is one of my favorite games to play with my kids because it really works on attention and the skill that we're working on. So you can laminate these, cut them out, and pass them out. So whoever has this card would read, I have Washington, D.C., who has vote. Whoever has vote would say, I have vote, who has president. So it kind of goes around. My kids really love playing these games, and it's a great way to work on whatever um, thematic unit we're doing at the time. Um, so there's 67 pages in all. There's tons of stuff in here. Hope you've enjoyed watching. This was a product preview of my election unit for early childhood or special education from Sasha at theautismhelper.com.